sticky sweet. Patrick? I thought I was Patrick. No, I'm SpongeBob, you're Patrick. Oh. Maybe we should turn on some lights and make sure. was sick. SpongeBob, it's too dark here! Do something! These cables are glowing! Maybe they feel pretty. Crab pizza is the pizza for you and me. Thank <laughs> you. 
I mean, <clears throat> Sandy. The name's Candy, with a C as hard as the toffee in Grandma's candy dish. Thank you for bringing the power back. We're looking for my pet snail, Gary. He got lost, probably kidnapped by a monster. Have you seen him? Haven't seen your pet around, I'm afraid. But that monster, they say its lair is in the museum. It's dangerous, but it might be your best chance of finding your little critter. Sounds reasonable. We should ask this monster if it's seen Gary. Patrick, I don't think monsters can talk. You know what? My little monster theater has been reset. You mind giving me a hand with putting it back in order? If you do, I'll open the way to the museum for you, so you can go look for that monster and your friend. I don't like it, but if there's a chance Gary is with this monster, we have no other choice. Oh, poor Gary. Let's get this theater fixed. arriving. Can't have a scary show with this jolly balloon bobbing about. these gallons of slime, Patrick. Gary must be terrified, poor thing. Maybe it's not all Gary slime. Maybe the monster caught a whole bunch of snails. More sweet babies in danger? Oh, say it isn't so. So learned.
can see my house from here! Oh, wait, no. That's a different rock. Bus drivers ever got their learner's permits. Look at all those snails the monster kidnapped! Look! It's scary! So how do we save Gary without that monster snail seeing us? Gary is the monster snail! Huh? They grow up so fast, don't they? These massive amounts of candy bars must have given him a sugar rush! Come like this? We have to cut off his candy supply first! Already on it, buddy! Such a cover 
for my buns? My buns? <laughs> Gary's gonna bring that whole museum down! We have to get him out of here before we're all buried in the rubble! But Gary is still giant! Don't worry. I'm sure he'll go back to normal once we get him home. I sure hope you're right, Patrick. I've never been wrong about anything yet. For once in my life, I think I might have been wrong. is covered in snail slime. Well, I just had it cleaned when I moved in, too. I know it's a very challenging situation. But could you stop yammering? I'm trying to concentrate. Uh, that was sheer luck. <clears throat> uh, Speaking of which, good news! I found that squiddy neighbor of yours. Just uh, give me more jelly and your new cosmic costume will get you to him. Maybe I'll just stay here and nap under my rock. Oh, sorry, Patrick. Balloons and heavy rocks don't go well together. Besides, we have to save Squidward. Fine. But Squidward knows we a nap when we find him. Nah, I look like I'm from the Stone Age. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like some idiot who lives under a rock. <laughs> 